I Inspire Towards Science, Engineering and Technology, or ICET, is a flagship project, um, a community engagement project of the College of Science, Engineering and Technology. And the project started in 2009. We have teams in schools which represent the project then in robotics competitions. And we also have short learning programs to um, equip our educators in teaching robotics in the classroom. Today, we're here at the World Robotics Olympiads, the regional competition. Um, ICET has 39 learners representing the project at the competition. It's really important that they participate in the wider community of robotics and they get to know each other and they get to network with other robotics kids. I think part of the strategy is to actually prepare the youth of today for a world unknown. Teaching and learning needs to, be, needs to change into an engaging way. So learners need to be exposed to practical experience in classrooms. So part of the, the learning from, from these um, robotics workshops or doing robotics is these other 21st century skills like problem solving, collaborative thinking, teamwork, where they're actually encouraged to, to share ideas and to talk to each other and to kind of take a problem and solve it on their own. And so by the time the kids have finished the workshop, they can program and they can apply engineering principles like friction and traction and center of gravity without actually realizing it. So there's teamwork involved, there's critical thinking, there's problem solving involved, and the application of math and sciences, and they learn without even realizing it. We have UNISA students who have volunteered and they facilitate these workshops. Then we also have a number of educators that are trained on the short learning program in robotics and they then coach and mentor robotics teams at various schools that we are working with. Being a coach and a mentor involves commitment. It also involves putting in a lot of hours and it also involves teaching the learners to build and to program the robots. Well, it has opened my, my eyes as a professional uh, teacher. Uh, I have realized that it's not only what is on the book that will make every student uh, like, actually love science. Even my students are starting to love science. Uh, I'm having bigger numbers coming in to want to participate in the robotics and also we have seen improvement in their grades in maths and science in classroom. So the hands-on activity are really paying off in my class and I'm hoping the 32 schools that are participating this year in Swaziland will also see, soon see the results. I really think that um, students need to get involved in community engagement, but on a volunteer basis. They get sent all over South Africa, they get an air ticket, they get accommodation, um, but the rest is for their learning and for their enrichment. And so by the time they graduate, they have an enhanced graduateness where they have experience and they know about community engagement. They get headhunted because of, the, of what they've learned presenting these ICET workshops all over the country. And so we're very proud to see that the learners have actually gained by volunteering. 